over the ball, the head must be protected. Oh! And that's a copybook thing. That oh! The, the Hello and welcome back everybody. Today we're going to be taking a look at a few AFL videos that I have not seen before. We got the AFL going on right now. I haven't watched as much as I would have liked to because I'm actually moving over to Texas. So this will be the last video here in this apartment in Florida. Uh, future videos will be coming out of good old Texas. You guys see I got the mullet already going for Texas and uh, I'm excited for it. I'm gonna give myself a cowboy hat. We're gonna do all sorts of fun things out there. But yeah, I haven't uh, caught up with the AFL as much as I'd like. So we're gonna kind of talk about the tipping at the end of it. I'll go over some more details with the tipping comp. If you haven't joined it yet, you still can. The link will be in the description. But let's take a look at a few AFL videos that I have not seen and uh, have a little fun with it, shall we? Let's go. All right, here we are. We got uh, Volatile Sicily, Sicily play, uh, play, uh, plays on the edge. I can't talk today. Uh, we got a player here who uh, likes to get a little spicy. I haven't heard of this guy, so I'm excited to kind of see what, what his deal is. Uh, I'm not sure if this dude's still playing or not. You guys will have to let me know all the details in the comments below, uh, like you always do. But let's let's take a look at this bloke. Well, Dust, I just noticed something at three-quarter time. Just a little bit of an interaction between two, well, let's say very confident young men, Adam Trelaw and James Sicily. Neither one of them James wanting Sicily. to take a backward step and just a little jumper punch there. Which one is Sicily? Sword. I don't think there's anything to worry about it, but neither one of them were going to have the last word with this one. They're going to keep coming back at each other. Good to see that little bit of bite play, but Collingwood, oh, we've got to focus on the fact this last quarter, he's got to be about the way they play now in the next few weeks. Neither one of them were going to back down, were they? Sicily. We know he's a long, long kick. And okay, the Hawthorne guy is Sicily. Nice. All right, all right. It's a nice kick. He has got the X Factor. Enjoying it in that celebration. It's one of those faces that, uh, you know, when you see that, you want to give it a bit of a mix up. You know what I mean? Gets the ball moving inside That's funny. 50. Right might be a chance to run. Got a bit of an ego side. on him. Sicily, interesting handball, no handball. Oh, he's mad. He's going back at him. Carlton, well set up. There might be a chance here to get out by the Hawks. Oh, oh, nice tackle. And nice tackle. Oh, but he's mad. Yeah. 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 And he leans back and slides it home. They go after him again. He just rams into him. Like, what the hell? Sicily. <laughs> It wasn't kicking in danger. Oh, he's having to go down. Well, it's not kicking in oh. danger. Oh. Having to go at his own teammate as well. Yeah, and I reckon Taylor Gerard ah. just telling him, mate, focus on the footy. Do you just get kicked to first half? A the falcon. In front. But you wouldn't know it when you have a look at players getting into each other. James Sisley, a moment that he'd rather forget. He caught one in the head. Taylor Gerard tried to tell him to pull his head in. Yeah, his teammate was like, go calm down, buddy. Just chill out. And he's like, Go F yourself. Get the F out of here, you know? <laughs> a little bit of a hothead. It's all good, though. A few other players did. He said, off you go to the other end of the ground, my friend. Back to where you belong. A few players had to calm him. Goes okay, short back into those shadows of the stand. Can't really see what's going the on there. stand meant that we didn't get a real good look at that spoiling attempt there, though. We, I'm sure we'll get another look at it. He's got a fitty. But that's Sicily. where Sicily plays on the line sometimes. Yep. And... His frustrations can boil over, and he can just throw an arm, or he'll get himself. Oh, he just like punched him in the ribs. Oh, what is that? Linking handball over the top, stretching Selwood. He's pursued here. Might have got him. He did in the end. Burton too high. Jay. Oh wow. Oh oh. Sicily's come in. Part fit wants to deal with him. Selwood. Selwood says, "I want the kick." All right, that's it. It just ends like that. Okay. All right, let's take a look at this. I mean, we learned about we learned about Sicily. And if I'm going to be honest, he kind of just gives me that vibe of like somebody you want to punch in the face. You know, I don't know. And I feel like he's just kind of that antagonizer on the field. That, that's the vibe I'm getting. Is he's the uh, he's that antagonizer that tries to tries to get with people, get in people's head. He's got a lot of emotion, a lot of what the fuck is going on with this court. But yeah. Either way, that that was uh, that was Sicily. So now we're going to see. Uh, it's a it's a short clip here. Um, a ball buster or a low blow or something. Let's see what happens. And share it. Gets the heel, just kept it in play. Good call by the boundary umpire. Yeah. Play oh, the boundary no umpire. way. You spot on, Jono. That's why you should always keep your eye on the ball, boys. Oh. oh. 
<laughs> All right, his dangly bits, bro. Oh, that's got to hurt so bad. It didn't even like hit the ground first. It just smacked him right in the nuts. Oh, terrible. All right, finally, let's see. We got straight to the tribunal. All right, we're going to watch some people get sent to the tribunal. The tribunal it sounds like uh, that was very dark and mysterious. I don't know. You know, I, I get this like uh, the, uh, the 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 committee. I guess you get sent to the, the committee where they, they they penalize you for for what you've done. If you've done something wrong and go to the tribunal, you you're gonna get penalized or something. I don't know how it all works completely, but it's got a little bit of a scary name if you ask me. I don't know. I don't know. Tribunal. Take you to the tribunal. I don't know. Let's take a peek. Just didn't get the contact. In right in the way. Blake, Ling, Solomon coming at him as Dean Solomon is wont to do. And I think he's been reported. What happened? Umpire's gone for his pocket. His pocket. This could turn very nasty today. We've got it under. Looks late on slow mo. And it doesn't oh, slow -mo. oh! Bigly, I didn't see the elbow on the first it. one. Dishes out some punishment. Too high. Down over the ball. The head must be protected. Oh! And that's a copybook thing. That oh. the, the teams at the clubs have been shown this preseason. <laughs> what is happening? What to do? Oh! Oh! Come Byron on. Pickett reported it's kind of... out of this day. Our cameras didn't capture it, but there is Farmer fallen. Stephen Baker, who you seem to think was in a scuffle with <laughs> him, the hell am I was watching? quite some time away by the time we found him on the ground without camera. Oh, he's yeah, on the ground. Look, I didn't see the point of contact, but uh, I saw Jeff Farmer fall, and he was a stunned person. And, uh, well, we see the blood coming from the... ...in that situation. He wasn't stifling over the boot. He was about two metres back in the gun. High tackle. High tackle. Front kick is going to chap him. You touched me, that's 50. Uh, I'm oh, you me, okay? I'm oh, you touched me, that's 50. That's hilarious. Well, at least oh, my gosh. Go. Bro, you touched, touch you touched me. You touched me, you touched me. Okay, you touched me. All right, all right, 50 meter. All right, now you get a free kick. Don't touch me. Yeah, isn't it? I to forget where he is at times. It was certainly a free <laughs> kick. <laughs> that ump was not having it. Oi, you just touched Not me. Again, sure, though, so he's getting up. There's nothing to kick to at the moment. As Hall oh, off the ball. Hall's, oh, Barry Hall has whacked behind play. That is ridiculous, Barry Hall. He has smacked Staker in the head, and he will be reported. Oh, oh. oh. I've seen that before. I love how I love how he literally turns around, punches the guy. A like, clean punches him. Like there's no like. Eh, it's a little just play it or whatever we're trying to fight for the ball no he just like clocks him and then instantly goes like what i do what i do what what, what was my what i do what do you mean what did i do i didn't do anything what do you, what do you mean like at least just like own up to it and start clocking everybody if you're gonna go for it like that i don't know that was just funny there, Barry Hall, that is the sort of thing that we thought was out of his game from that eddie had under the roof adams who got the first goal of the match <laughs> Is he giving him an arm bar? What is happening? <laughs> oh! It's a free kick to Jack. Carlton free kick, Chris Carlton. Well, upset them because he grabbed an arm. That was most unusual. Is that a full brother to the chicken wing lead? You know about those sort of tackles. <laughs> he put him in the chicken wing. Adam's is hurt. Oh, it's a wrestling move. All right, that was a fine set of videos. If you ask me, I haven't seen those before. Some of the clips I've seen before, but there's some good stuff. So uh, to end off uh, this video here, I just wanted to touch on the tipping comp that I'm doing. It's a free tipping comp. I'll have the link in the description. You can still join. Uh, you can join any time throughout the year. But I am doing a $100 gift card to the winner of the tipping comp. So let's take a look. We are in what now? Round five. Uh, and so we got the, uh, the first place here so far is Pugs. Dion is in first. Uh, you guys can again go check this out yourself. The uh, links in the description. We got Ethan in second though. I do know who Ethan is, so that's awesome. Ethan uh, is is doing very very well. We got Brock here. I know Brock as well. Uh, a few of these guys I've chatted with in the past. Voodoo Gaming definitely know who that is there. Uh, top ten. So we got a lot of guys, some regulars in the top ten. So that's pretty cool. And I wouldn't be surprised if you could still get you know up there. Maybe even still win it if you join now. I don't really know. If it's too late for that or not, but I feel like there's still a lot of footy left, right? I'm doing really bad. I'm, I'm ranked 76 out of 78. I've been, I'm gonna not lie to you, I've missed a few um, tips here and there just because 
of all the packing and the moving stuff I've been like doing, I've honestly, and the, the time difference makes it hard because I forget like things are a day ahead and, and I miss out on some of the tips that's happened in the last couple of weeks. So, but it's not about me doing this tipping comp necessarily. You guys are the ones who could potentially win. Again, uh, I'm giving away a hundred dollar gift card to the uh, AFL store. So it's the AFL store dot com dot au or it's probably maybe just dot au for you guys i don't really know how that works but yeah there's all sorts of cool stuff on here so i will basically at the end of the season i'll find the winner i'll get the email and i will just um purchase a gift card on here and give you an email it's you the code and you can like uh use them as gifts so there's a lot of cool stuff on this afl store if you want to win a hundred dollar gift card to it um you guys definitely still have an opportunity but yeah let me know what you think of the mullet hope you guys are having a fantastic day i'm gonna be uh in texas pretty soon so i'll, I'll have some videos of uh when i get to texas and uh, the new setup i'm gonna be in a little bit nicer place and i'm excited to put my studio together so hop over in the discord too if you want to chat with me um i might be doing a live stream i haven't decided yet it's kind of traveling uh moving like this it's, it's tough to do live streams and stuff for but we'll see how it goes hope you guys are having a good one i'm gonna get out of here peace love we'll catch you later it's been fun from florida hope you guys are having a great day cheers